Welcome back to the SST classroom. Students, in the last video, we discussed about the concept of transport. Right students? I hope students, you all have completed your activity. Okay? Now, let's move to the another concept that is communication. Okay students? Now students, do you meet all your friends and relatives every day? No, right? So students, how do you how do you keep in touch with all the people you know? You send and receive message, right? So students, the process of sending and receiving message is called communication. Okay, students. So, what is communication? The process of sending and receiving message is called communication. Okay, students. Now, students. Now, students. In ancient times, people used to communicate to their near and dear ones through sign and symbol. Okay, students. So, they send message by beating drums and giving signal through smoke and fire. Okay, students. Smoke signal are used by army personnel even today to send their messages. Okay. Now, students, let's see the different means of communication. Students, nowadays, we use different means to communicate with people living in other place. Right? So, they are postal system, mass communication, telecommunication, computers. Okay? Students, one by one, we are going to discuss all these concepts. First, we will start with postal system students postal system is the cheapest and oldest means of communication okay so the postal service is still the most popular way to send and receive messages okay students we buy inland letters postcard stamp and envelope from the post office okay students we write letters and put them in stamp envelope okay then we write the complete address on it and send it they reach our friends and relatives within a few days students an address is incomplete without PIN code. Students, you are confused about PIN. P-R-N means Postal Index Number. In India, PIN code has 6 digit. P-R-N is the short form of Postal Index Number. Okay? So, students, a letter with incomplete address and without stamp may not reach its destination. So, students, this we talk about the postal system. Students, the postman delivers letter at the destination. Okay? So, the PRN code ensure the speedy deliver. If you put proper pin code, so your letter will be delivered at proper place. Okay? So this we talk about the postal system. Now students, let's move to the telecommunication. Students, telephone is the fastest means of communication. Right students? It is Direct means of communication. Students, do you know who have invented telephone? It 
was invented by Alexander Graham Bell. Okay, he has invented telephone. Okay, students. Now, students, you can call up a friend living in the same city and in some other city and even in some other country by using telephone. Students, today people prefer to buy mobile phones instead of telephone, right? Because you know mobile phones they are handy. Means we can keep in our pocket and we can go anywhere. We can take the mobile anywhere, right? So students, I hope you have understood about telecommunication. Now students, the SMS means short message service is rapidly becoming popular for sending message. So students, a fax machine is connected to a telephone line. You can see here in the image, if the telephone line is connected with this fax machine, then we can send our SMS. Right? It is used to send written messages, documents, photograph to someone instantly. Right? Instant messages and letters can be sent via fax with the touch of a button. If you want to send your message instantly, so you can fax. Okay? With the touch of a button. I hope students you have understood about the telecommunication.